Hey guys, welcome to Tony's Autos. In this video, I will show you how to fix not responding program Windows 10. So this is going to be a very easy one. So let's get started. So the first thing that you want to do here is we first want to troubleshoot the application that we want to fix. But before we start troubleshooting, we first have to shut down those applications first. So just click on your keyboard, Control Shift, Escape. And from here, you just want to search for the application that is, isn't responding properly. So for example, if your Firefox isn't actually responding properly, you just need to just click on it. And from here, just click on End Task, and that would actually end the task for that application. So once you've done that, we are now ready to go to the troubleshooter. So here, just click on the windows at the bottom left of your screen. And here, just click on the settings option. Now under settings, you want to go to update and security. And under update and security, you want to locate troubleshoot. So here, it's usually located at the left panel of our screen here. Just click on troubleshoot. Now from here, you want to click on additional troubleshooters. And under additional troubleshooters, you want to scroll down a bit until you see the program compatibility troubleshooter. So just click on it. And from here, just click on run the troubleshooter. From here, it's going to detect any issues that you have on your computer. But once it's done, it's actually going to let us choose the program that we're having issues with. So for example, if you're having issues with Access 2016, just click on Access. And from here, just click on Next. Then the next thing it's going to do, it's going to try to solve any issues for this one. But from here, it's going to ask us if you want to try the committed settings or troubleshoot the program. Now, but for this one, we're going to use the try committed settings. Then from here, it's going to ask us to test the program. So just click on test the program. And from here, it's going to launch up the uh it's, uh, it's the program itself or the application itself. And when we actually go back into our uh, setting here or troubleshooter you'll see that it's still the same thing so you just need to close your application again and from there if you notice any changes or if you're able to actually use the application you could just basically just click on next then from here if that actually solves your issue you could just basically just click on yes save these settings for this program and from here, it's going to save those settings where it actually work. And from then on, it should probably work on your PC now. So if that doesn't actually work, then the next thing that we want to do here is we want to change the boot up settings for our application itself. So for example, if you're having problems on this application, just right click on it. And from here, you want to go to properties. Under proper properties, you want to go to compatibility and under compatibility, we'll have to enable a few settings here. So for example, just click on run this program as administrator and you also want to click on disable full screen optimizations. Then from here, if you haven't done the troubleshooter before, just click on run this program in compatibility mode poor. And from here, you want to choose Windows 7. Then from here, just click on apply and OK. And that should actually solve your issues for your not responding programs in Windows 10. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.